G'day guys, welcome to the episode. Today I've got Yarn with me, mate from Wollongong. What's up? <laughs> and we're going boat camping. He's come down to the bay, got our swag, he's got everything, dive gear. And tonight we're going to try and catch a dewey, or Yarn's going to get his first one hopefully, on the rod. Oh, on rod, mate. <laughs> I'll put a photo of his right here, what he got on spear, but he needs one on the rod. So we'll just try and get some squid and hopefully we can get a couple in here. It's pretty clear. We, we got some squid, but we want some fresh squid and maybe some liveys. So hopefully we can get a couple and then tomorrow we might get in the dive gear Maybe fad, maybe bombies, who knows, but we'll try and do something fun tomorrow and get some good fish But yeah, see what happens Phew. The yarn's on, second cast It's a nice little one It's, it's actually not, not a bad one It's not getting shot in the face <laughs> That's a not bad, not bad one not bad, eh? Pull it up. If you're getting inked, it's going on YouTube, mate. <laughs> That's oh. a good squid. Oh. Chuck it back straight over. Oh no. I saw that happening, eh? Harry's on. Oh. It's not a bad one. It's got a little squid with. So I'm gonna try and keep a couple alive. And if they die, then we'll just cut them up. Yeah, not, not a bad one. Not That's bad. Oh, oh, almost got ya. <laughs> <laughs> My rod was just in the rod holder and it just got smashed actually. And I was just putting that one in the live bait tank. I really need to get a live bait tank. I'll do it one day. It's a bit better size, is it? Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Showering. <laughs> there we go. The bad one. There's your mate. Stay in there. So we got two squid, lost one, and it's about four o'clock. So we're just trying this one last spot, see if we can get a couple more. I got bitten off, I don't know how, but yeah, on the braid. So I don't know if something bit or just they're not broke, but yeah, we'll quickly just try here. And if not, we'll go back into the river, set up camp, and try and catch a dewy. We've got one dead squid bait, just a big strip, something like that, from the other day when I caught a few with Dante. And that's just been frozen pretty pretty fresh still and then the two that we've caught yarn's just got one under the boat and i'm gonna try and cast mine we've actually got them snelled up i'll just quickly show you what that looks like so you've got one hook so it kind of means no matter where the dewy kind of bites you're gonna get hooked so three rods three chances of getting a dewy no matter which one goes off first yarn's grabbing it no not true and just loosen the drags a bit so we can wake up or we can hear them when there's a dewy. Cooking up some dinner, no fresh seafood today. Could have actually had the squid, my squid died. So probably could have eaten that. But fresh bait for tomorrow. Drink your beer mate, you pussy. Down it, for the YouTube. <laughs> Loves his beer. <laughs> Cooking dinner, <laughs> oh, what the hell? no way, no way. Cooking dinner, and I just got a 30 centimeter dew fish. <laughs> we'll let this little guy go. He's legit like 30 centimeters, but that's good. Good sign that's that we're in dewy. Yeah, there he goes, straight down. Just watching the bait runner. Right it's getting a few taps. Nothing crazy. There's a few bigger ones just then, but. Usually with Jewies, they just take it because they got those big mouths. So it might be a little flatty or something. Oh, it's a flatty. Oh. <laughs> I thought I had another Jewie. It's a good solid flatty. Oh, that's a sick flatty. That's my PB. <laughs> <laughs> Not a bad one. That's a sick flatty. Let it go though. Just get a measure on her before you release her and 50 on the dot. So I'll just swim her for a tiny bit to make sure She's ready oh, to go. Oh, she's her. gone. Look at her. <laughs> Look Chilling. at her go. <laughs> oh, that's sick. What the hell? It's swimming in the current. <laughs> and oh, there man. she goes. Just give one. We might have fish on. Just give it a little. Is it heavy? On. Yeah? Yeah. <laughs> Could be. <laughs> so you had a fish yeah. on the whole time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> a flatty fish sitting there. Kind of it's right. going hard. Finding pretty hard. I'm not giving it some luck. 
That's your right. <laughs> what is that, bro? <laughs> Spew it. <laughs> what is that? Chop the freaking mine, bro. Uh, uh, Man, he's swimming. <laughs> yes. Oh, oh no, look, it's no. now. Oh no, it's now. Look at it. There he goes. What a soldier. That little one. Put a fish on. <laughs> oh, first chewy! <Yeah>. <laughs> you thought know, you were on the bottom! <laughs> no way, the juice are going off today, they're tidy, but that's first chewy on the wrong Yeah! Congrats, bro! Cheers, brother! <laughs> <laughs> they're getting smaller and smaller. <laughs> there he goes. Swim straight off, good release, mate. Still a chewy. <laughs> yeah, we set the swags up. We're like trying to. Just, we got one rod out each, and just oh. little Jewy Jewy in bed, bed time <laughs> Jewy. <laughs> Jewy in bed, bro. <laughs> few beers, a few swags, everything's up the front. Two swags for it well. Or the one big day deluxe probably would fill right as well. But yeah, single swags go pretty hard. Good morning everyone, it was a crazy night. We ended up going Jewfish after Jewfish after Jewfish. Y'all have a quad Jewfish and how many did you catch last night? Like about 10 at least. Oh, at least. <laughs> now about this big, but it was crazy fun. Like on the light gear, they go a little bit hard, but they were just under the boat. Like you could see them take the bait and it was, it was honestly amazing. There was no complaints from us. Even though they were tiny, we didn't get, oh, we got the little flatty, I guess, and that catfish. But yeah, mostly just tiny little Jewfish, just all under the boat. Heaps of fun. Ended up putting a live video on Instagram and Heaps of stories on Instagram, so if you're not following us there, I'll put the links below. Because you miss out on a lot of extra content if you're not, and if you want to see more offshore adventures, I guess that's where to go. Yeah, today we're just going to pack up. It's not too foggy, steam down the river, and then head out the front. And depending on what it's like out the front, if we'll dive or fish, but we'll probably fish for a little bit because it's cold as. And then once it warms up a little bit, maybe get in the drink for a little dive. But yeah, crazy night, all up to the tide change about 11pm. Heaps of fun. Yeah, my first little, little tiny little soapy. So yeah, but we'll see it once we've packed up and ready to go. Yo, couple stags for breakfast. Just getting a few fresh squid from the local squid hole. Pretty nice day. It's just so cold right now. I think it's like five, six degrees. But the sun's slowly warming up, and these sausages will warm us up. Then we'll hopefully get in for a dive, and get some fish and some maybe some craze, but some. But yeah, if we can get some good bait, once the wind dies down, we'll go for a snapper flick. Hopefully get Yarn's PB. Came for a bit of breakfast, and we could eat squid, but we might just save that for tonight. Because my mum's birthday tonight. Happy birthday, mum. Oh, if you're watching this, say happy birthday to mama as well. But yeah, I can't even talk, it's so freaking cold. That's perfect, right? That's what we got there yesterday. And ink me. No way. <laughs> We're just going to hop in at the island for a dive. We're both just going to jump in, just anchor it up here and just see what's out there. The viz isn't too good, so we'll just probably not give it much, but if there's fish, then we'll stay in. But yeah, we're both taking GoPros and we'll just leave the boat anchored. Hopefully get a few fish and then the wind still is howling, so hopefully it dies off while we're in there and then we can go get a few snapper as well. But yeah, wish us luck.
Big squid alert! We're actually done, done. We got a mixed bag. You guys just saw that we thought we'd come for a little snap or flick or maybe another dime. We just saw this massive squid under the boat. Beautiful squid. We just come out snapper fishing. I'll just show you guys what we got diving. I guess he's throwing the video, but we'll hold some up. I got a nice little salmon. They're yeah, not very good eating. You can do a fish cakes all right, but I, I mainly just got it for bait because I don't like buying bait, you know. You get fresh bait out here, squid and salmon and stuff like that. and don't have to buy any. Nice big black drummer. These guys are really good eating. Nice little trevally. Not amazing any, but all right, sashimi. Little brim. We've got plenty of squids. And yeah, I've got a nice blue moe. Nice goat fish and a pretty solid brim. Probably the best fish of the day. Yarn's on to the first snapper of the day. <laughs> on the snapper lead, any size? A bit of weight? Yeah, a bit of weight. Yeah. A kingy! Oh, it is a kingy! <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, that's my yarn! <laughs> oh, that's mad! <laughs> Rat King boys and girls. <laughs> nice little Rat King. Onto good a good fish. dog. On the squid head, whole squid head. We're just about to pack up and leave and go diving because we've like stuffed this. There's a nice head shake. I think we've got a nice snapper on. Could be oh. a king again. Yeah, it could be. First one of the day. It's not fighting that hard actually. There's a bit of weight to it, but. There's a bit of colour. Yeah. Snapper. Yeah, nice little snapper on the squid head. Nice panty. We probably well, we could let him go. We've got a fish. Yeah. Up to you, Matt. We'll get a quick photo and let him go. I invested. Actually, I didn't invest anything. Anthony from Complete Angle about this way just gave me one. Instead of using a knife to pop a swim bladder, just a little needle, so it's not as bad. So it's not much of a hole. Quickly swim him for a couple seconds. He's ready to go. No, he's not. He's not ready to go. There he goes. Last little one. Off to fight Phew. for another day. We're going for one last dive. The conditions have glassed off, but we only managed that one snapper. These are the exact same conditions as when I caught those 20 snapper in the one day, but yeah, only managed the one on the squid head. Yeah, we'll try and go for a dive, try and nail a snapper with the gun because they are breeding at the moment so there might be a few in close. Try and get a couple more good fish on the spear gun to take home. And yeah, it's just like pretty green in there, but we'll just jump in and see what it's like. You know, might as well get in and just see if we can get a couple fish, but if not, then it's all good. Yo! Just got in for our dive. It was probably really short for you guys because I didn't get anything and Yarn got a few good fish. Nice brim and a nice blue Maui. And a nice goatee, I think. Yeah. But I missed a lot of fish, but yeah, Yarn didn't have his GoPro on, so we didn't get much footage. <laughs> it's a nice day out here. It's not too windy anymore. Just right. Just a little sucker. Stop taking my alarm lock. <laughs> <laughs>
Got the squid cut up. Fish is getting ready. Everybody say happy birthday to mum in the comments. It's mum's birthday, so I'm spoiling her with some fresh fish and calamari. About to cook it up. I think Yarn's in the shower. So yeah, but fresh fish, can't go wrong. Bit of fish cooking. Chef Harry in the kitchen. Okay, mate. Oh, it looks beautiful. Thanks for helping. Looks Thanks beautiful. for helping cook it. Day three, we are at the boat ramp. It's a beautiful day today. Going out the island with Yarn. Sam's here now. He got to the house real late last night, so you guys didn't meet him. Something real bad happened on the way here. It's about an hour drive, but on the way here, my whole winch just broke. Like we put a D shackle on now. The whole winch just broke. Didn't notice until I got here, and it was so lucky that. Yeah, the winch was just not on. All I was holding it was the safety chain. But we made it. I love your beauty. I hate the trailer. I hate the trailer it comes on. I just hate it. I'll one day probably get a new one, but you know, it's, it's a lot of money just for another trailer. But yeah, we made it. That's the main thing. Nothing bad happened, but could have been. Sam, welcome to the channel, mate. You guys haven't met Sam, but we've dived together and these two are doing a dive tomp down here, so. Yeah, we thought of taking him out to the island and hopefully get a kingy or first first snapper. Yeah, we'll get head out there. There's a few dolphins out there, and we'll see you on the water. You and we're prim, we're basically just diving today. Ooh, we've got a fishing rods just in case, but yeah, we just want to dive. And anyway, I see you on the water. You. I can see the bottom in 22 meters of water. It's nice and clear. Any fish? Oh, I can't see any fish yet. <laughs> Just dropped the boys on the other side of the island. The other side wasn't too bad, it was just, wasn't that fishy. And it was more protected and had to come in because my anchor didn't hold and, yeah, I don't know why, but anyway. I managed to get the big goatee. I only shot one thing because it was just massive. It's definitely my PB and they do taste delicious. We're doing a time share, we're just gonna have two in the water, one on the boat the whole time. It's a bit safer that way, don't have to anchor. Always kind of watching and we can dive different spots, not just the one back there. So yeah, we'll keep moving around. Hopefully we can find the kingies and, or bonito or some pelagics like that. But I better move the boat because I'm about to crash into the rocks.
There's bus stops everywhere. It just came out deeper and there's some fish getting smashed by something big. The big key is I reckon a big bonito. Dropped the boys in in about 40 meters. And they said a rat and a bonito came up to the flusher. Yeah, might need to go in soon. Oh, it's just bus stops everywhere. It's crazy. The boy is unpacking. Ended up just, yeah, didn't feel the eskew, but got a few nice fish. One big ass goldie, about 43. Nice king wrasse, 40 centimeters. Got a few other fish. Yeah, no kingies, unfortunately, or bonito or pelagics. Still have fun? That's all that matters. So much fun. That's all that matters. But we were all kind of not going for feeling the eskew, just wanted some good fish. But couldn't manage any kingies, but still an awesome day. See you, boys. Enjoy your dive comp and follow these. Thanks, no worries. Thanks for the ride follow the boys. Oh. What is it? Sam underscore yarns underscore adventures. Yeah. <laughs> On Instagram. I'll, I'll, put, I'll put it there. Well, and I'll put his. And I'll put baby. his. And I'll put mine. Don't forget to follow mine. That's the most yeah, important part. So yeah. Bit of a mishap this morning with the with the safety. But yeah, we'll fix that in a second. I'm just going to Sam's house to fix that. And yeah, it's a pretty good dive. Your beauty. Like a cat, nine lives. It happens every time I go for a long drive, there's something happens with this trailer. But still, <laughs> I haven't lost it yet. Alright, cheers boys for coming. Yeah, had a ball, man, eh? Catch you back in Wollongong. Catch you there. And I'll catch you guys next time. Don't forget, hit the like, hit the subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Phew! Without you. <laughs> <laughs> You're so weird. <laughs> <laughs> You're such a pussy. <laughs> so many bedtime jewies. You. How's the setup? Oh, I'm getting in. Thanks for the commentary. <laughs>